So for today, we're going to be looking at the Veil type set. If you guys don't know, this is the armor from the seasonal activity. So the like witch queen looking armor. I finally got it. I say finally, I got it like the first uh, two days. I think it was first the first day I got nearly all of it except the class items. And then the next day I got the class items. So I got them pretty fast. Unfortunately, it did take me a while to make this just because, again, I'm making a lot of videos like a lot. So bear with me. I do have a lot of things to do, but I do have a list of things that uh, just to make sure I can. So for today, we're going to be looking at the Veil Tithe set. If you guys don't know, this is the seasonal armor for Season of the Witch. And I actually think this armor is pretty cool. We're going to talk about how it looks, how it shaders, my personal thoughts. And I will have the shader video, which essentially, if you guys don't know, I make uh, or I show you guys all of the shaders that I currently own with the armor. So. For the hunters i will show you all of the shaders that i currently own and for the titans and warlocks as well that one is a longer video just because i do have a lot of shaders so if you just want to specifically go to a certain class i already have timestamps for that same thing for this one if you guys just want to see the shadering or you guys just want to see my opinion i have uh time steps throughout the whole video so that way you guys can just go to the one that you want to go to so if you guys like the video like comment subscribe let me know what you guys think about the armor itself because i i like it but at the same time i'm like i feel like there's just weird some weird spots to it so yeah let me know what you guys think other than that veil tight set here it is i think it's pretty cool we're going to be going through the hunter titan and then warlock uh for those of you who don't know the way you obtain this is basically through season of the witch you're gonna have activities and you can just buy them from the ritual table, which is what I ended up doing. I just bought most of them from the ritual table. They do cost two engrams, but I definitely think it's worth it because sometimes RNG is pretty terrible. So hunters, I think the helmet is really cool. I just wish the eyes glowed and this is not just for the hunters. I wish the warlock had the same thing. I wish the eyes did glow because then that would be really, really cool. Titans, you guys don't have eyes there. But I think the slits on like between the helmet and then the jaw, I think the slits glowing would have been mad. That shit would have been wild. Uh, chess piece hunters, I'm going to be real with you. I think the chess piece is probably the most boring piece from this whole set. Uh, and you guys might be wondering, oh, well, that it has that little frilly thing on the chess piece. That's cool. It's actually part of the cloak. So that's really unfortunate. If it was part of the chess piece, I think it would have been cool. But unfortunately, it is part of the cloak. The arms, first and foremost, symmetrical, which means I love them already. And they're actually really, really cool. So I'm definitely going to be using this for a hive themed look because, it, I mean, it has hive carapaces on it. So why why not? Uh, boots, I will say I love the boots, but at the same time, it shaders terribly. Uh, you guys will, well, I, don't, I shouldn't say terribly, but it just shaders differently, I guess you would say. I think all of it looks cool. Thank God they, did, they didn't just give us like a boot at the bottom. They gave us like carapace boots, which is really cool. Even for the Titans, which Titans, that's really, really cool. Even Warlocks as well. So definitely whoever designed this needs a raise because this was really cool. The cloak, however, I'm not the biggest fan of. Um, I just, I think it's the frilly part. I think if that was connected to the chest piece, the, the cloak would have been super dope just because I'm not the big fan. I'm not the biggest fan of the frilly part, but it's still really cool um still gonna be using a bunch of these i've already done the individual sets uh for those of you who don't know i basically use each piece from the armor aside from one armor set that i use two pieces but usually i will use like for example the arms i'll make a whole set around the arms for the boots same thing and for that video specifically i think i ended up using the cloak and the chest piece if i remember correctly so those videos are already going to be working on. I'm going to be working on them because I already have the Hunter Titan and Warlock already done. I just need to edit them and make the voiceover. So again, making a lot of content for you guys, but I need to because next week raids going to come out and I'm going to be really exhausted from it because obviously we're going to be trying to do the day one. But uh, Titans, I think I'm going to be real with you guys. I love all of it. And this is really weird because I just objectively, I should hate the helmet, but I think it's so cool. Um, the arms are my favorite piece from the whole set. It's, a, it's symmetrical for one, but the example set that I made with the arms, I fell in love with. I am legitimately just enamored with it. The chest piece is super dope. That being said, it's really hard to combine with certain helmets. 
Uh, so just be aware that the chess piece, while cool, is going to give you a, a bit of a hard time just because I feel like the chess piece has a certain look that it wants to go with. And if you don't lean into it, it's just going to look weird. Boots. I love the boots. The boots are super, super dope. I actually love the example set that I made with it as well. And then the mark, I'm going to be real with you guys. I don't really care for it. I mean, it looks cool. Definitely looks cool. But I like I do not care for the mark at all. Like, let's just say that I think everything else is super dope. Mark is like the least best part from this. Like, so I'm just like, whatever's Warlocks helmet is super dope. Chest piece is super dope. The arms I love. I love the example set that I made with it because I lean into like a vampire look and the boots are super cool as well. I think everything is damn near really, really good, except the bond. I mean, granted, the bond looks really cool, but it looks a little bulky and that's like my biggest gripe about it again this is like super small things that shouldn't really bother people but i didn't just notice it because i'm terrible like that but overall i'm really happy with the seasonal armor set that we got just because i love like all those pieces i am utilizing in a lot of sets that i'm doing titan specifically those arms are beautiful hunters helmet and boots are super dope warlocks helmet and the chest piece i love a lot and the arms as well so like le legitimately no one lost in this personally i don't think anyone lost in this one i think everyone ate well as for how it takes shaders As you guys saw the shadering is not bad it's just the fact that like for the hunter specifically there's a lot of different different colors in the actual cloth and that's pretty much for every almost everyone i should say because the titans have that for the boots as well but then for the warlocks it's actually the chest piece and the arms so it's not a no it's not like super duper like i hate this and it should die it's more of like i just have to work around it specifically for the hunter boots i that's what i literally did i just worked around the different textures and colors and i made it work same thing for the boots for the titans uh warlocks you guys have rougher time just because it, the chest piece is like the chest piece it's like your main focus so you're gonna have to work around that one as well but overall i do think we all got really good sets let me know what you guys think in the comments below overall i'm just really happy uh again I will have the shadering video out soon, probably like not right after this one, but the same day, most likely. And then the individual sets, I'm going to be working the, on those as well. And then we're going to be working on other armor pieces, specifically like the exotic, uh, the new exotics that we got this season. I'm going to be making the Hunter Titan and Warlock videos, hopefully by the end of no, by the yeah, by the end of next week. And then I'm going to be doing the ex exotics from last season that I didn't do for the hunt, the Titan and Warlocks because I just time got away from me and my hard drive died. So I have to redo the video essentially. So a lot of content. I'd appreciate a like. Tell your homies about it if they're into fashion or if they're not, just tell them to up their game in fashion because, yeah, Destiny has a lot of cool fashion in the game and I would like to see more people. I also am working on a Discord. So if you guys want to get into the Discord, let me know let me know if you guys just well i'm still gonna do the discord i don't know why i'm gonna ask you but yeah i'm still gonna do the discord i'm still working on it but for those of you who are interested just let me know other than that be safe and i will see you guys later <laughs>